Hey, this is Waffle Productions and Scott. Third video uh, today. We just tried to get everything yeah. out. This is our update of the mm, Busby Double Shot Double Barrel Shotgun. Yes. Um, as you can see, it's modded to look like a old Western sawed-off double barrel shotgun. Came out sick. Very cool. Yeah. Now, uh, we'll start up from the top to the bottom of the gun. Now, start from the barrel. I'll start first. It, it it's, used to be longer. So. Yeah, it had about this much longer of a barrel. It's yeah, we, we made it sawed-off. Yeah, the, oh, the barrel. Oh, the barrel's right yeah. here. I'll get it. The, One sec. The barrel. This, the barrel is pretty long. It, it, it's good for cocking it back. Yeah, it's it just tells you to now. cock back. Yeah. Um, but as you can see, so much shorter now. It was Now it can be a secondary, which is good. I would use it as a secondary. Like, it's kind of like the Ranger, as you probably know from Modern Warfare too. For all of you who play. Yeah. But um, otherwise, this thing... I'd say 30 foot of range. I'd yeah, normally get. The, the shorter the barrel, the more range it gets. Yeah, I get about 30 foot. With a stream, uh, with normal stock darts. Mm -hmm. Sawed off the barrel, I got 50 with the normal stock. I uh, tried in the streamlined darts, the Nerf streamlines. Do you have any? Whatever. Uh, it's fine, it's fine. Yeah, uh, okay. All right. Uh, the Nerf streamlines, you know, the orange ones, we tried those. And damn, did it go far. We got 71 feet on yeah. a double barrel. It's Great. Yeah, very and nice. tell them how you have to cock it back. Well, yeah. We're going to also do a slight review. You're going to take the front, cock it back. See here, clicks. As you can see, it's sloppy in the middle. We're still touching it up. And then you push forward and shoot. shoot, shoot. Be able to shoot two, two bullets. And yeah. Um, I'll show you how fast I can shoot it. Those yeah. two bullets. Yeah, if you cock it back, like, to it, like... Bar, then, then, like, if you pull the trigger once, it'll shoot both. If you, yeah, if you listen, one click, two clicks, and that was the third snap. Yeah, well, it's kind of hard to do slow motion. Yeah, but uh, as you can see, we got a, a silver and a leather brown onto it. Let me try to move the light so it's easier to see. Yeah, but um, remember how we told you before how you have to cock it back for it to shoot? Well, well with, with the barrel the, extension, it was a lot easier. It was much easier. You have to, It's more of a hassle to pull it down, but yeah. it, it's it definitely doable. But if you look around, you can see sloppy spots. I told you we're still touching it up for the last time. Don't leave any comments. You suck. All right, now, it did normally have iron sights with the barrel, but since we sawed it off, it's got no iron sights. Now, I was thinking about sawing this part off and putting it back on but forgot to and uh otherwise really nice 71 feet with uh the streamlines angled angled uh, straight i never test but these iron sets are useless now it's well as you know most nerf ones are pretty inaccurate well yeah besides the long shot and the maverick yeah they're pretty accurate but yeah uh came with the shells, which are right in that bin, get me that bin right of it. Sorry, we weren't really prepared for this. No, 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 the, that, or yeah, just give me one shell. Now we, we, the we, shells used to be orange. Yeah, they used to be, you can see the inside. They're, yeah, we painted orange. them, we painted them red to make them look like real shotgun shells. Yeah. Well, they, they kind of look orange from the gleam of the light, but. Yeah, it's, it, they're really red. That's orange, as and you inside. See. Yeah, but they're really red on the outside. Now it's much thicker. What you do is you open it up and you gotta insert one shell. Insert like insert the other shell. Yeah. Fire off your two shots. Then when you're done, you open it up, push this out. Sorry, yeah. it will eject <laughs> yeah. two shells out. Yeah, they fly out. Yeah, it's annoying because you kind of have to look for them. But yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a good gun. It's more realistic, too. Well, uh, like well, every gun has some downers, but, yeah. yeah. The only downers on this gun, goods and bads. Really big bad, reload, definitely a bad, and clip size, definitely two bads right off the bat. Yeah, that's the problem. Two shots, then it's a very long reload, so. But yeah, but you do get this pouch in the back. It's a good for sidearm, like, if you're ever screwed in there for it, just pull it out and go, pff, 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 right, and yeah. you're good. So, it's a great weapon if you're playing 
Nerf Wars where you get down and you can be revived if your teammate's downing. As soon as you, you know how sometimes you, some people can't shoot when they're down. Well, if you can shoot, or if you can't shoot, as soon as you come back, two quick shots, and yeah. you'll take down two people. Not very good for crowds over four, over two people crowds, so it's bad because it's only got two shots. Have a mag strike ready if, the, if you see a big crowd. <laughs> yeah, I think we'll be insane. Well, uh, thanks for this review. This is Patrick, a.k.a. Wa um, Wild Productions, and my friend Scott. See ya. Bye.